What is going on guys welcome back to another video i hope you're having an amazing day and today's video i'm going to show you a little app especially for good lock users if you love to customize your phone or just manage your phone better with the one ui's good lock system you will actually like this so let's just go to the github page of the app this is a neat little third party free app called bad lock which is an alternative manager for the good lock and fine lock so if you just scroll down Reimagining the Goodlock experience, an alternative user-friendly client for managing Samsung's Goodlock modules built with Jetpack Compose for a modern and fluid experience, which is pretty neat. And this is the main one. Feature Smart Update Checker reliably checks for new versions of installed modules using official APK Mirror RSS feed with a robust HTML fallback. Now, this is what FineLock doesn't offer. And even with Samsung's good lock, it won't show you a bunch of the models and plugins which are actually supported by your phone, but Samsung just want to gatekeep it because of the lower version. Maybe as you can see, this is a Galaxy S24 FE, not clearly a flagship model. So Samsung does actually gatekeeps bunch of the modules and just depending on the country. For smaller countries or third world countries, you don't have a lot of the stuff available, which is supported, but just Samsung doesn't care. So going down, you have instant loading, app loads instantly, with cache data while refreshing in the background. You have automatic refresh, automatically checks for newly installed apps when you return to the app. Then you have modern UI, performance, basic stuff, app info. This is how the app looks. If you just completely scroll down, you can just download it. Again, this is just released couple weeks ago. So let's just install the app quickly. Go to install. takes a bit for a small little app hit done and we do have the alternative called fine lock in which you can actually install a module from outside and then just access it completely i do like this thermal guardian which is not available in india but it's a very handful tool if you just want to limit your thermals a bit but again as you can see i'm using an older version made for one ui 7 now it has been updated and made better for one ui 8 along with few bug fixes but as you can see no updates it's telling me nothing about the updates i can actually hold on the app to manage it if i just want to quickly uninstall or view it on the play store which won't be available even on the galaxy store as it's country locked but scrolling down it will show you pretty much everything that samsung has to offer but bad lock takes it a step further so let's just open the app as you can see it's already telling me that the home app has an update if I just go to the life up, which are the extra plugins, it does tell me Thermal Guardian has an update and then just updates in general. So if you just go down, you will see a lot of stuff, which pretty much even I haven't noticed, like even the battery guardian. I did actually use app booster a lot on my Galaxy S22 after a couple years of usage. So you can just check out that and then you can manually refresh to just check the updates as it usually runs on the cache data. So let's just update the Thermal Guardian quickly, which has been updated to the version net. So if I just tap on update, it will quickly guide me to the latest version of the app. As you can see, Thermal Guardian 8. So let's just select the app. Scroll down to download APK. I can click here if it doesn't automatically begin. And this app is quite vital, especially when you are transitioning from one ui 7 to 8 a bunch of the models are being updated so if you are already on one ui 8 and if you are waiting for the good luck modules to catch up this is a neat little app you can use open the app works just fine and if i just return to the bad lock refresh it once as you can see it's detecting the app has been updated i can directly go to the app info clear the data uninstall it and yeah, that's basically it. A neat little quick app for managing your good luck modules. I hope you guys found it helpful. If you did, please drop a like and subscribe down there for more like this. See you guys in the next one.